When you and your passengers are having problems with cell signal coverage on the road, and you find yourself in need of a more cost-effective solution, there's always DriveX by WeBoost. DriveX is our standard multi-user cell signal booster for in-vehicle use. Compatible with all U.S. carrier networks, phones, and cellular connected devices, DriveX puts an end to the dropped calls, missed texts, and slow data speeds you may often experience while on the road or driving through remote locations with fewer cell towers and unreliable signal reception. And when it comes to faraway towers, the DriveX is capable of enhancing cell signal at distances up to 33% farther than the Drive Sleek WeBoost Single User Vehicle Booster. Installed in minutes without tools, DriveX is ideal for all types of people and vehicles. Simply put the Minimag antenna in place on the rooftop towards the center, but away from existing vehicle antennas or sunroofs. Run the antenna cable through a side door or hatchback for vehicles with an aluminum body, an adhesive mounting disc is included. Then, connect it to the DriveX booster. Connect the inside antenna to the booster. Finally, connect the power supply to the booster and power it up. Right away, everyone in your vehicle will start to enjoy better voice quality, uninterrupted text, faster data speeds, and improved streaming capability anywhere the road takes you in the U.S., regardless of the carrier or phone they use. There's a more affordable way to get reliable cell signal coverage. The DriveX by WeBoost. We've updated the turn-by-turn -turn directions to make them easier to read and to better handle cases with complex maneuvers. Active Trip is now available when you're on a trip. Inside the Active Trip activity, ending a trip is easy. If your destination has a phone number, you'll have the option to call. If it's a contact, you can now tap to let them know you're on the way with a call, share trip, or a short message. You can also see a list of all of your upcoming maneuvers and traffic on each segment of the route. We've added traffic and speed camera indicators on the map with optional audible alerts to help you avoid getting a ticket. Map mode has a new speed limit sign which appears when you're exceeding the speed limit. We've also made significant updates to dash mode. Many of the gauges are now more responsive and we've added a number of new features including several new gauges that keep you driving safely. The speed limit gauge always shows you the speed limit of the current street. The new drive score gauge helps guide you to be the best driver you can be. It starts at 100 and keeps score on each drive. 
Speeding, excessive speeding, hard braking, hard acceleration, and high G maneuvers reduce your score over time. The engine temperature gauge shows you when your car is warm and ready to go. And your G-meter gauge shows your lateral G-forces when you accelerate, brake, and take tight turns. You'll see the G-force indicated numerically, as well as the direction intensity of the force. You can now customize your dash and select which gauges you do and don't see. in addition to selecting the center gauge. Quickly replying to a text message while on the road has never been easier with Navdi. You can now reply to messages from a glance, selecting replies like, I'm on my way, and I'm running late. You can customize these messages using the messaging section in settings in the Navdi mobile app. We've made the menu faster and more responsive. In the top of the menu, the activity tray provides quick access to map and dash options. Active trip, now playing for your music, unread glances, active phone calls, and software updates if they are available. No matter where you are in the menu, a simple swipe to the right closes the menu and gets you back on track in map or dash mode. New Almond Digital Inspection Mirror allows you to view and capture those hard to see areas and you can increase trust and credibility by showing diagnostic inspection images and videos to your customers. As soon as you get it out of the box, the first thing you have to do is make sure it's charged up by plugging in the included USB charging cable. The red light indicates charging, and once it goes out, it's fully charged. Now that it's charged up, you just have to simply thread the camera onto the telescoping handle, tighten the locking thumb nut, and it's completely assembled. Using your smart device, download the app from the App Store or Google Play, or refer to the instruction manual for a QR code you can scan. Now that you've downloaded the app onto your smart device, turn the camera on and it'll send out a Wi-Fi signal. Use your smart device to connect to it. Now you can see everything the camera sees right on your smartphone or tablet. The head flexes to any angle and the telescopic handle allows you to extend it just a little bit or all the way to its maximum length. You can really get back behind into some hidden areas if you're looking for leaks, dropped nuts or bolts, or lost tools. It can also give you a quick look at suspension components or brakes without having to pull a wheel or lie on the ground. Also available is this flexible shaft for additional adaptability and you can wrap it into some pretty tight spots. Also, you can turn the light on and off and adjust the intensity as well as take still shots and video.